As a YouTube creator, you have the ability to actually control what ads show and do not show on your channel. Did you know that? Well, today I'm gonna to show you where you can go real quick and make those changes. Let's go over and check it out right now. Go to your Google AdSense account and what you'll see down the left-hand side here is blocking controls. And then you'll see YouTube host. And let's click on YouTube host. You can break, open that up to all channels if you have more than one channel. Then you see, make sure you've had the right ads for your brand. You can prevent uh, URLs from individual advertisers. So if you know the URL of the ad that you don't want shown, you can add it in uh, here. Or you can go and block by uh, category types, like sensitive categories, or just pick the general categories you don't want to watch. Now, if it's in particular a URL for, say, something that is either a competition to a sponsor or something that might be uh, something you don't believe in, political ads, you can block with some of these other category information. But generally, if you know the URL, you can go to manage advertiser URLs. You can see I've put one in here already on my account. All you have to do is enter up here a URL or URL separated by a comma. So if you want to block anything from like a company, if you know the, the direction where the, ad, the ad's directed to, you can usually tell from the ad itself because it'll have a URL on it. If you can find that URL, type it in here and then add it in here and make sure that it's blocked and you won't see ads from that URL hopefully appear again. Unless, of course, the same advertiser advertises with a different link, say a landing page or something like that is completely different to something they may have used previously. You just have to keep blocking them individually. So that's URLs. And if I go back... So if you want to block sensitive categories, you'll get a list of categories here. Astrology and esoteric. See, I've already previously blocked alcohol and gaming and betting sort of stuff, but gambling and betting, I should say. You know, I've even just blocked a few more now, so they're all blocked. And of course, if we go back out, if you've got general categories like computer and consumer electronics or food and groceries or different things like that, you can go and search those in here as well and add those. So they get three different ways of blocking ads on your channel so just make sure that on this left hand side when you're applying this you're applying it under youtube host all channels and that'll apply to all youtube channels that are connected to your adsense account there's some pretty simple controls on your google adsense account to block those ads as long as you can identify some of the urls particularly if there's an ad in question then by all means you can block it real easy if you didn't know about that let me know in the comments and if you did and you have some more information about other ways that you can stop ads from appearing on YouTube videos, let me know in the comments below. And did you know I have a Buy Me A Coffee page? You know what, I've linked it in the description below and I've also put it up on the button on my banner page on my YouTube channel. So if you ever want to support and you're not on a live stream to drop a super chat, then why not buy me a coffee? Check out this video right here before you go. It's got even more YouTube content for you. Make sure you come back and check out more videos as I release a video this time every week. This is Doug, and I'll catch you later. Subscribe to Doug Hughes and YT for more tech for content creation.